My name's Rick Rogers, and I'm a ghost hunter. Just kidding. I hunt all evil spirits, not just ghosts. Got an unusual gift a year ago, the ability to defend against dark forces. Started my own agency, Paranormal Files. Hello, I'm Nikki Summer. Are you Rick Rogers? I need your help. Thanks for getting back to me. A year ago, my friends and I were staying in a country house. There were strange rumors about people going missing in that area, but we didn't take them seriously. When the group played a prank on Tina Rise, she ran away from the house and disappeared in the forest. I think the same thing could happen again this year. I got a strange message saying that if we get together in that house, it'll all happen again. I did some digging and this is all I found. Will you take a look? Let me introduce my friends. Elliot's the life of the party, and he's super handsome. His parents own a house in that cursed forest. Eliza can be a bit arrogant, but she's really popular. Terry is a football player, and he's pretty quiet, but he's also super kind. And finally, there's Tina. She's quiet and inconspicuous. I suspected that she was in love with Elliot. Elliot and Eliza played a joke on her and she ran away from the house. I went after her but couldn't find her. I asked for your help because I've been looking for answers for a whole year. I think something's lurking in that forest. Something supernatural. I also received a strange letter saying that history will repeat itself. But I don't think a ghost could have written it, right? As for the forest, a lot of people have gone missing from the area. Take a look at the map. Elliot's parents' house is on the edge of the forest. Now I see how they bought this house for so cheap. Elliot's dad is an avid hunter and he doesn't believe in any of the stories. I learned that people started to disappear almost 300 years ago. Back then, there was a settlement here with mines and caves nearby. I think the locals angered some spirit before leaving this place, but that spirit still roams the forest at night. I know it must sound ridiculous. I hope my research helped you get a grasp of what happened. My friends are already at Elliot's house. Here's the address. If you're ready, we can go. so quiet. That's not like my friends at all. Something stupid happened before we left. Elliot tore off the amulet Tina gave to me before she disappeared. It's important to me, so we got into a fight. Elliot said that the amulet would be waiting for me here in the safe so that I'd come back. The last thing I said to him was that he was a fool. It seems so silly now. Please, help me find out what happened.
Hey, Nikki, we've been waiting for you. It's been super boring. So we're heading out to the woods to see what kind of monsters are really out there. <laughs> I doubt you'll make it three steps before wanting to come back. Look in the safe while we're out. Your precious pendant's there, just like I promised. Tina gave this pendant to Nikki. That's what caused Nikki and Elliot to fight. I should give this back to her. Well, what's in the house? Well, there's good news and bad news. The good news is that Elliot brought your pendant. The bad news is that your friends went into the forest. Seriously? Are they nuts? We have to do something to help them. But I won't even take a step in the forest without a map. I downloaded an updated map of the forest on Elliot's laptop when we were preparing for the trip. Download the map on your phone. Here, this might come in handy.
Tough luck. The camera's broken. The only way to watch the recording now is to connect it to the TV. Elliot, why do you like going on strange adventures so much? And what did you hide from Nikki in the pantry? That's the best part. She'll find out when she finds it. But the adventure isn't going to happen. I forgot to hide a paper with the code. Well, I think we'd better go back. Vampires and werewolves are afraid of our brave crew. Guys, someone's there! Very funny. We aren't gonna fall for it. Seriously, turn around! <laughs>
Well, Ghost, can you fly out of that pit yourself? Very funny. No, I can't get out.
Well, hello, ghost. I'm Rick Rogers, a hunter of your less-than-alive colleagues and other evil creatures. I'm investigating this forest. I'm Jessie Rise, Tina's sister. She went missing here a year ago. Sorry for this charade. I just wanted to scare the people who were gathering here today. I found Nikki here, even though I sent her a message saying not to come. She's the only one who really helped search for Tina. Oh, when I fell, I hurt myself. I can't move. Could you help me with some first aid? Here, I found it in the forest. 